I love lasagna. That's how much I love me some lasagna. Can you take pasta out of the lasagna equation and make something spectacular? You gotta make the quickest tomato sauce in the world. Grab a little garlic, coin-sized pieces of garlic. A little bit of olive oil into a nice warm pan. Just break it up. In the meanwhile, I've got some canned tomatoes. Take your tomato sauce to a different stratosphere. Take the actual rind off the Parmesan. Break it. <laughs> We're gonna throw this in. So tomatoes in, a little bit of salt. Bada bing, bada boom. Give it a good mix. And we'll just kind of let this cook for about two minutes. Fresh, quick tomato sauce. You see how my, my voice went up there? Fresh, like it was like little Mario right there. Zucchini. This is gonna take the place of our pasta. You need a mandolin for this. And just carefully slide it through. And it should look like this. I'm gonna literally pour the tomato sauce out. Next, I'm gonna make a bechamel. Big knob of butter. Try and eye the same amount of flour right over that butter. It should almost be like a paste. Milk. I'm gonna add about half of this. So we'll give it about two minutes just to get nice and thick. I've got a little bit of basil here, and I'm just gonna kinda take the top stems and all. Check out the bechamel. See how thick that is? So I'm gonna kill the heat. I'm gonna take some Parmesan. A little salt in there. So I'm gonna take a little bit of this bechamel, kinda spread this to the edges, and just lay them in. Add a little bit of basil. Grab a little bit of that tomato sauce. We'll do a little bit more bechamel. You guys get the idea. All right, a little bit more cheese in between each layer. This is gonna kind of help it stick it together. And here we go again, another layer. So I'm on my final layer. So I'm gonna take this bechamel, put it over the top, spread it all the way to the edges. This is super important. Mozzarella, shred this guy up. Mozzarella, extra basil. A little olive oil just the top. Some Parmesan. This baked for about an hour, 375 degrees. Look at this thing, man. Basil, stems and all, right over there. And that's all it takes for lasagna not to feel so guilty. And it's joining its lasagna buddies right in here. <laughs> for more recipes, head to joelgamron.com.